Thank you for visiting me on YouTube. Today we're going to talk about Bob Barr. The former Georgia congressman is now running as a libertarian and he's running for president of the United States. This will make some impact in the election because Bob Barr is from the South and most Southern based conservatives tend to lean towards libertarianism. And that will make a difference in either Senator Barack Obama or Senator John McCain's chances at winning the South. Right now, most of the South is solidly conservative, which means solidly red. Barack Obama's campaign is trying to at least chip into some of John McCain's leads by going into those states and trying to promote his brand of politics, which most people are not hip to because of the issues at hand with conservatives and how the Bible Belt does make a difference in how a Republican can win the White House. Well, the Libertarian Party, a group that nobody seems to be paying attention to, a group that has many people like Larry Elder, Bill Maher, and even some congressmen who are tended to be like that, although they still run Republican. Now, in particular, we have talked about Congressman Ron Paul, the Republican from Texas who ran the presidential campaign and generated a lot of youth support. And most people loved his message of liberty and restoring our Constitution, as well as bringing our troops home. But his style of politics is more conservative. With most of the young people swaying to Senator Barack Obama, some of the people who are swayed to Ron Paul are dissatisfied with the choices that they got to vote for. So I give them that option of going to either Libertarian Bob Barr, the Democratic candidate Barack Obama, or the Republican candidate John McCain. I mean, they have a choice. But I always told you that Bob Barr does make an impact in how the South sways for Republicans. Right now, Republicans who do not approve of Senator John McCain's pick of Governor Sarah Palin of Alaska will probably definitely secure their vote for Libertarian. But most of the people from Ohio right now are trying to keep them off the ballot, like Cynthia McKinley or Chuck Baldwin or even Bob Barr. They're trying to keep them off the ticket because they don't want to have the mistakes of Ralph Nader sway this election. And the Democrats are really desperate not to have Ralph Nader on the ticket. Ralph Nader, Bob Barr, Cynthia McKinney, Chuck Baldwin, they're the third party candidates. Of course, you know, a lot of people are not giving them the props because the media is focused on the mainstream Democrat and the mainstream Republican, so you, that's how you feel. But I always give this option. That 6% that usually goes to Bob Barr can make a difference in either one of these candidates' victories or losses. I mean, think about it. You live in the South, right? If you live in the South, you support gun rights, right? Are you a pro-life person? Are you a person that believes in civil liberties? Are you a person that doesn't want to be meddling in other people's affairs, but stand, well, you stand on the principles of defending your own homeland than defending someone else's homeland? Well, you know, that's what a libertarian is. They are free thinkers. Many libertarians are known they're known in the entertainment industry, like John Voigt, for example. You got people like Kelsey Grammer, who's a conservative, but he tends to be more libertarian. And you have people like Dennis Miller. You have, once again, I say Larry Elder. And, of course, Bill Maher. All these men and women who are part of the Libertarian Party believe in principles of restoring liberty back in the Constitution. They believe our freedoms are being taken for granted. And with President Bush allowing 700 billion dollars going into financial crises and establishing another government organization that makes more republicans more lenient to go towards the libertarian party am i right or am i wrong that's why i always offer y'all this choice post your comments at the bottom and tell me how you feel about libertarian candidate bob barr or give me a feedback on what i'm about to tell you you know he picked a running mate as for his libertarian ticket by the name of Wayne Allen Root. But Wayne Allen Root is thinking that it's best that Ron Paul will be his running mate. Do you think it would be a better idea to see Barr and Paul together on a ticket? Send me your feedback, and I'll catch you on the next one.